Hey, what's up guys? Tony my face here. And today I'm going to do something a little different. I don't know why, but I just woke up this morning and I was like, I'm gonna tell a story to my viewers. I don't <laughs> I don't know why. I I just I feel like I have to tell this story. It's not very important, it's just something that happened in my life that I feel that I should talk about. I don't know why. I've told my friends like a gazillion times because it's just like the only thing I'm proud of. <laughs> but anyway, um, this is about my first fight, and this was in grade. This was in grade five. No, four. This was in grade four, so I was about, about 11, 10 years old or something. And basically, there was this kid, and um, he used to always call me a pineapple head. I have no idea why. I didn't, my head does not look like a pineapple. If anything, it looks like a, an apple. I don't know. Anyways. So he would, he would walk up to me and he would call me a pineapple head and he'd walk off and he'd have his little giggle, his little fag giggle. So one day I was just like, oh, I'm sick of this. So after school he was walking home and I walk up to the back of him and I put my shoulder on his, my, my hand on his shoulder and he just turns around and he gives me a straight fucking punch to the face. Like I was so surprised and he just turns around and he keeps walking like a, like a badass. I'm just like, ugh. <laughs> My nose! Well, it, didn't, it wasn't really bleeding or anything, I didn't get, end up getting a black eye, I just, it was a straight up perfect punch to the face. So I went home and I was a bit upset that day. <laughs> so um, I was kind of, I was, actually it kind of made me scared of him, I was like holy shit this guy's got some balls, he just punched me in the face without giving a shit. So the next day, I'm at school and I'm just walking around with my friends and I see him up the top of the playgrounds playing handball with his friends and I'm like, I should, I should do something about this, I should like, get my vengeance or, you know, show him who's boss. So basically I went up there and I, I don't remember the full conversation, but I was giving him shit, he was giving me shit. And we were pushing each other, we were getting up close to each other, we were ready to fucking, you know, we were ready to fight. And um, I remember he tried to, he tried to tackle me and I literally just let out a full uppercut into his face. So he, then, I hit, I hit him straight in the face, he turns up. I left hook him, and then I right hook him, and then he tries to punch me, and I dodged it like a badass. And that's pretty much it. After that, after those three solid punches to the face, he just fucking like walked off with shame. Like he, I'm pretty sure. I don't know if he had a black eye the next day or not. I never really talked to him ever again. Never saw him, you know. But he was. I, I know. I definitely sent him that message. It was honestly an, an awesome. I, he never actually said anything. Like we went to class, he was in my class, and um, he never said anything. We just kind of looked at each other, like, "What do you want?" He's like on the other side of the room. We, ne we never said anything to the teachers. It was all kept a secret. Only the people in the playground saw it. And that's basically it. That's basically my story. I feel like I had to tell that story. I have no idea why, but maybe um, in the future I will make more of these little commentaries on my life and how retarded it is. But anyways, until then, peace.